All right, Ira Busto back at the general booth looking at Cohiba today. Uh, coverage brought to you by Cigar Oasis. What do we have new with Cohiba? What's going on, gang? Uh, this year in particular, we're we'll going to be the Cohiba Spectre 2019. And we'll kind of walk you through the packaging. Look at that. Similar to last year, you got 10 cigars per box. Uh, of course, individually coffin. Different coffin this year, but I have any cigars in the tubes. And Beautiful. that's for security reasons. <laughs> uh, very expensive cigar. Uh, well, not terribly expensive, but pretty expensive. We're talking $90 per cigar. So this is a $900 box of cigars. And uh, super exclusive. I don't know if you guys are familiar with last year's blend, but this one's a little different. Also, I forgot. Look at this. Authenticity. Boom. So you're extra special. Yep, yep. You got it. So this year the blend is a little bit different. We actually have a five-year age Alapa Valley wrapper, A's and Tercios. The binder is wrapper grade Connecticut Broadleaf. And in the filler you have more Alapa Valley tobacco, actually from 2006, also A's and Tercios. 2014 SLE tobacco, sherry barrel age with a little Brazilian Montefina and Pelota Cabana. So this blend is gonna be a little, little bit heavier than last year, but just as decadent, just as savory, a little bit of spice, more sweetness all the way through. Just an absolutely fabulous cigar. Medium plus, super limited, only 180 boxes commercially available. So if you see this in your humidor, uh, at your retailer shop, then you must be somebody special because this is very, very limited. Time to buy it then. Yes. <laughs> Cheers. And we got a Connecticut too. A new Connecticut. And Not know, quite $90. No. <laughs> and not quite a full box, but you guys are probably familiar with this. So the story on the Connecticut, first time that we've ever done a Connecticut Shade Cigar for Cohiba, and what we really wanted to do was offer a Connecticut that was a little bit more challenging as far as its profile. So what we ended up with was basically six different leaves, five different countries. The wrapper is an Ecuador Shade Grown wrapper grown in the Los Rios region of Ecuador, binder of San Andreas, and in the filler, you have Brazilian Montefina, Velo de Cabano, a little Lee Harrell from Jalapa Valley, Nicaragua, and also some Lord Dominicana from uh, the Dominican Republic. So this is more of a medium body Connecticut. has a little bit more weight, a little bit more body, but still those nice inherent profiles you like from a Connecticut shade cigar. Creamy, buttery, uh, nice, uh, just chewy smoke. But again, more on the medium body side, but very well balanced, great cigar. Make sure you pick one up. Pleasure, brother. Appreciate your time. Cheers.